Welcome back to Samsta Games, the place to find new strategy games and welcome to another demo that's part of the Steam De Game Demo Festival and that's Spy Hack. Today it's time to hack stuff. So we'll switch our profile so that we have the whole new text and all that. So we can do intro text and all of that. So I'm gonna be Samsta, I'm gonna be a woman and we'll play on medium. Let us begin. Is that us? That's probably us. I mean, we're the woman, so we gotta be the one tasing him down. <laughs> okay. ATD management want to know what is the real goal of that project. Your mission will be to get into the main quarters of the Bee Farm Corp. We will install satellite transmitter on the servers with Homodoo's database. All right, let's do it. Let's go install some stuff. All right, so this is where we are. I'm just gonna close this because I actually, is actually voiced over. Click your left mouse button. I'm in the Bee Farm Corp reception, next to the elevator. Well, I can see you, James. There is only one synth guard nearby. I'll take care of him. Just try not to damage corporation property. Synths are expensive. They serve octopuses on corporate events. Pretty sure they have enough to buy another synth. Can see we're not big fans of synths. After activation, you will see colored fiber optic cables, which leak. All right, so we activated this control device, which allows us to connect to cameras. Well, actually, not us, but our hacker friend, which I'm going to call Team after on my patrons. And this means that we can see into the other rooms. So now we've got this guard here staring in the other side. So what we're going to do is we're going to tase him. The object you. And then what we have to do is we actually have to mask his body with these nanobots, so any other guards that come through will not see him. That's super important. Now let's go check this control device so we can see into further further rooms. Now we can see a bit further ahead. Now these cards are moving, so we gotta figure out the right way to go in there. Now it's really important that they do not uh, see you, because they can shoot you with a gun and you're like insta-dead. So you don't really have much time here, so let's, let's mask his body and run away. Can you run away please? Okay, good, 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 good. We are... Saved. Now, when you kill a guy, they make a sound. Like, I mean, come on, man, just be quiet. I'm just trying to kill you. Can you just not be quiet? Apparently not. He just me screams. And so the other guy, if they're close enough, they hear it. And then they, you know, they just go and save their body. So it's like a bit irritating. Something to get to watch out for. Now, once he turns around, I'm going to go tell the girl to go and tase him from behind. We we'll also use our handgun because he's the only one here, but we're not going to. Oh, hi, girl. Yes, she tased him before he hit her. We could mask it, but we're gonna keep the nanobots. We don't actually need it. Now we're gonna go and check this device. Some nodes are protected by fire. I've got an access to the elevator. Great. Now move to the 11th floor. Copy that. Alright, so this device is actually protected, so we still can open this. But I feel like this, this is gonna say not hacked. So what we gotta do is we gotta hack this manually. So this is going to be moving and you have to st click stop when the triangle is at the same spot as this thing on top. So we're gonna do it now. Now. And it looks like an envelope. All right, we did it. We successfully hacked it. So now we can get inside. Now we have to move here, which is our objective. Oh, I finished. In order okay, to no, it's not. And we're gonna move to the required destination and to the next mission. We did successfully. Didn't even need to use all of our masking nanobots because we destroyed them, no stress. We only tasted him, we didn't even kill him, like come on. We could have used the handgun, but we were nice, because that's not what we do. Install satellite transmitters on the server with Homodoo's database. When the transmitters will be connected, our hackers will copy all the data. I'm on the 11th floor, next to the elevator. Let's see what they have here. I have visuals. We are in the Bee Farm Corp test laboratory. This fits the data we got from the spy. Any suggestions? There is a DNA synthesizer in the second lab cubicle. 
On the far side of the cubicle, you will find a router. It could give you control over the doors of rooms near the server room. Shall I lure the guards in there and lock them in? Exactly. And the problem with this is I don't actually know how you should lure them in because the problem is you have two guards standing here. And you're supposed to lure them outside, but then how do you actually do that? Like I, I did it in my test game, I got rid of all of them, but I wasn't able to figure out like how to lure them. Because the moment you go into the area, they will be able to shoot you with their gun, so you won't be able to do much of anything. So that's kind of a problem. So I'm not quite sure how we're gonna handle it. First you gotta get rid of these three guards, which is pretty easy. Uh, we just have to kind of time it properly. The other guy is still up top, so we might. I think we're gonna have to wait. We're gonna have to wait here at the back edge of the wall because he can only see as far as this sort of green thing goes. Like, assume that they're kind of like hiding or hugging the wall, so we, since we're pretty far, he can't see us that well. Once he moves to, we're gonna go and taste this guy. Maybe what we're supposed to do is if you were to kill, because you can't, I can't, I haven't figured out how to shoot like, um, nowhere you know like you have to shoot at somebody so presumably maybe if we try to shoot the last synth with a gun it will make a sound and then potentially they could be lured to that that could work like we'll we'll see i'm gonna hide here behind this actually we could just go up we're gonna run behind this wall Now we gotta remember that we gotta keep going because this guy's gonna follow up there eventually. Could run here, but I don't know. Yeah, let's go up here. Should be fine. And this guy's going to turn downwards, presumably. Or inside, okay. Now we can run in and we can tase him. Use the nano mask. And then we're going to run this way. Hack this. To give us connection to those rooms. And then what I'm gonna try to do is I'm gonna try to kill this guy with a gun. And presumably that will lure him in. Now before we do that, we should use our Trojan, Killer Trojan to on this device. Because then what it can do is you can activate it and it will kill anyone in the area. Or we could just lock them in, that's also an option. But it's, it's actually disconnected, so we can't. Right, let's let's run that way. Oh, not this way. What is she doing, girl? Okay, that, that that was fine. Try to use the kill trojan on that device. Oh, we haven't hacked it. We gotta hack this first. This is a very bad time to hack. I'm in an air. Come on. Run, run, go, run, run. <laughs> Now they're alerted because we messed up the hack. So we're just gonna stand there. Now they keep on moving. That's good. I need to go and hack it again. Go and hack this. Again, I messed that up. I was gonna try to click it quick, click it quickly. It just okay. It, again, they're just like not doing anything. It's okay. Just gotta follow him around. So they tell us to try to lure them inside, but how are we supposed to do that? It didn't say it very clearly. I mean, I could tase him now, but I'm trying to not do it just yet. He <laughs> can't notice me this close to him. Because none of these objects are like interactable, so there doesn't seem to be anything you can like turn on in order to get them to come. So we have to hack this. Okay, I'll try this again. Nice. 
I rehacked it. Now we should be able to place the killer trojan here. So that means that if anyone comes near it, we can activate it. Now, maybe now, if we were to activate it when he is near it, maybe it would allow us to kill him. Let's let's run that way. Can this be activated from a distance though? I mean, presumably. Yeah, once he gets near it, I'm going to use this. Kill the torsion thing and see if it kills him. That's something that's going to be helpful for us. Yeah, does it alert the other ones? It doesn't. See, this is the problem. Like, I don't know how to... Or can I just click on and hack it from a distance? Protected. The protected switch node can be hacked automatically using the firewall destructing virus in the same way like with hacking regular firewalls in order to hack the switch node manually when the security symbols... Wait, I would rather hack it manually? Oh, I can. Okay. What do I have to do here? Oh, I have to figure out which one it was. It was up here on the top. So we're all good. Why is it not letting me click on that one? Oh, I have to figure out more than one virus? I have no clue. Okay, we'll try this again. So, third and fourth is the right place. Oh, you have to find a different one. I think it was here? And then there? Oh, that's the wrong thing apparently. Guess we get like one round. So then it was up here. Oh, it's, it was not allowing me to click, sorry. <laughs> I was trying to click it, but it just it wouldn't let me. So here is one, and then there is one. Success, good. We hacked it. So now... There's a rabbit there. Can I... Like, just open the door from a distance? Yes, okay. Then I'm gonna open this door from a distance. And I'm... Okay, that thing is dead. That's great. Can I just lock you in? Where is he? Oh, he's on the inside. No, he's not. Okay. He went... But no, 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 I'm back. I think just killed him. We also just like lock the door. Maybe that's what we should do. Let's wait for him to get inside and try to just like lock the door. Like close it and lock it. Can he like not get outside? Now he cannot get outside now. Good. Now you've got a killer rabbit there, which is not ideal, but we're fine. Oh, this isn't still hacked. Where do I have to get to hack this? So we have to click. You can click this on the GPS and see. So it seems like we still have to hack that. Oh, the it. firewall How protecting this? virus allows you to hack firewall protected nodes very quickly. Select the firewall distracting virus. Right, so we use the firewall. Okay, so we're gonna use this thing apparently. We're gonna do it with like an automatic thing, but you know. So we left one guy alive. We're kind of nice. Now let's get inside. I'll open the door, please. Transmitter set up. Good job, James. Let's check 3034, and then we can go home. I like that plan. <laughs> the rabbit just murdered him. Like, absolutely no stress. He just killed him. You also need to get into their internal communication service so the ATD expert could download and analyze content of their correspondence. Alright, we'll try. We've got here. Alright, so we gotta start by hacking this. Only one more server with the database and we can go home. Don't forget about setting up the transmitter on the mail servers. We need to the question. internal communication of B Farm Corp. Be good. 
Now, what kind of doors do we get access to? Node may also look like an arrow. This is a proxy server which delays signals sent to devices and makes hacking them slightly more difficult. Click on the arrow to. Okay. So we got just one guy, so we should be able to get through pretty easily. We're gonna have to wait for him to come back though, I think, before we can tase him. Once he turns around, I'm gonna run behind him and tase him with my... yeah. With the taser, go. Go, go, go. Again, clean up his body as usual. Now we could try to put one of these uh, killer trojans on that device, but I don't think it's necessary right now. What is this though? Let's let's look at it. Oh, so we can like make it flash so that they're gonna come towards it. It's actually kind of interesting. Now, how do I get to this door? Because this door is not hacked. Okay, so there's there's a thing here, so let's open it. Or hack it, I should say. James, there is a lot of guards in the corridor that leads to the server room. Try to lock them up in empty offices. On your right, you've got a room with mail servers. Set up a transmitter there. There is a router that could grant you an access to the room with the database server. Thanks, Q. I'm setting up remaining transmitters and going back home. Good luck. Alright, so we have to uh, like get them into the offices and lock them in. For example, I could grab this. Oh, it's not hacked? It's not hacked yet. Okay. So we gotta hack it here. Right? Now, I'm going to hack you... No. What did I hack then? You successfully hacked something. Oh, this. So we'll just lock you in because the guard is already inside. What about you? Can I? I can. I can lock you in as well. Wait for this guy to get in, and we shall lock the door and close them. Also, unlock this door. I'm not going to open them just yet. Lock the door. Close it. And that should be it. I think so. We did keep this open. Do we need this? Doesn't seem like it. But this one is not hacked. So presumably there's gonna be somewhere I have to go to hack it. Oh, sorry about that camera move. That was a bit cruel of me. But I hope you forgive me. Alright, we could use our GPS thing to figure out where is that last... Like, this door. It doesn't say what it connects to. We already did that. Huh. Interesting. I don't think I can interact with in this room. Doesn't seem like... So maybe that one of these offices is where we have to get inside, too. It's like, I can't get in there, right? Alright, what I'm gonna try to do is go and kill these guards one by one. Maybe the problem is that one of them has like a key that we gotta get or something. I don't know. Keep standing like that. Come on, move, man. But right, I figured it out. We had to get inside here, so we're going to do that. And this will allow us to install the transmitters that we need. And then hopefully we should be able to get 
inside this room, yes. So we can just go outside and write down. Alright. So we are finished with our mission missions. Got what we need. Let's go. Alright, so this is the end of the demo. I hope you enjoyed it. I'm looking forward to seeing this game when it's uh, finished because I think it's a really cool RTS. Uh, if you would like to see some other games that are part of the Steam Game Demo Festival, you can click on the right to watch them. I'll see you there. Bye bye.